It's a beautiful day for football as the campus of the University of California Berkeley is buzzing as students and fans alike prepare for the opening of the 2010 college football season as the California Golden Bears host the UC Davis Aggies. I'm Kevin Cohen here at Memorial Stadium welcoming you back to another edition of the Cal TV Sports Highlight Show. As with any other season, Cal comes in with high expectations and this game today should provide an early season indication for what the season holds in store for them. The college football season is upon us, so let's get to the highlights. Cal is looking to make it a perfect 6-0 in home openers under Jeff Tedford. The Bears get it started right, get it started quickly as senior quarterback Kevin Riley finds a wide open Shane Green, who hauls it in for a 23-yard touchdown strike. Then Riley hooks up with junior wideout Marvin Jones on a slant for a 13-yard touchdown to push the lead to 14-0. The defense holds and forces Davis to punt. Senior return man Jeremy Ross goes back and fields it at 41 and finds a hole to run. He breaks it into the open field and gets tackled just before the 20. That would set up the trickeration. The defense is confused. Keenan Allen is not. He knows his way to the end zone, taking it 18 yards on the end around. The first career touchdown for the true freshman from North Carolina. The Bears don't let up. They continue to attack through the air. Riley airs it out for Marvin Jones, who makes a spectacular catch despite the defensive back being all over him for a career best 51 yard reception. The Bears D stifled the Aggies offense all day. Keith Browner sacks quarterback Randy Wright for an 8 yard loss. Not a good day for Wright, only 8 for 22 for 57 yards. Cal would march down the field and Shane Vereen slices and dices on his way to a 7 yard score, making it 28 nothing Bears. On the ensuing kickoff, Davis' Elon Wyatt tries to make something out of the return, but gets a case of fumbleitis. Cal's J.P. Harrell recovers the fumble, setting up another 7-yard Chamberlain scamper as he pounds his way to the end zone for his third touchdown of the day. Now up 35-0, Riley finds Keenan Allen on a short crossing route, and no one's going to catch him. Allen flashes his big play potential, housing it from 48 yards out, finished with four receptions for a buck 20. Quite a college debut, and you know Oski's got to be loving it. Davis would get on the board with a 43-yard field goal by kicker Sean Kelly, cutting the deficit to 42-3, but that would be the only bright spot for the Aggies. Bo Sweeney relieving Kevin Riley can't find anyone, so he trots in for the TD one more time for good measure. Giorgio Tavecchio would tack on a field goal, and that would be all she wrote. Cal wins 52-3 as Jeff Tedford passes legendary coach Pappy Waldorf on the all-time Cal wins list. Kevin Riley led all passers going 14 for 20 for 258 yards. Shane Vereen added 67 yards and 14 attempts, while Marvin Jones reeled in five receptions for 81 yards and a touchdown. Cal certainly showed its offensive prowess today in rolling up 52 points on the Aggies. With his three touchdown passes today, Kevin Riley tied for seventh all-time on Cal's all-time passing touchdowns list. Up next for the Bears are the Colorado Buffaloes next weekend right here in Memorial Stadium. For Cal TV, I'm Kevin Cohen. Make sure to tune back in next time to get your download for what's up in Cal Sports.